Hello everyone, ciao and welcome back to my channel with Valentina Chimico, the beauty archaeologist. Today's video is for you if you use hot wax to get rid of unwanted body hair or if you want to give it a try and you bought your fox kit. I've been using hot waxing for a very long time, in my opinion it's a cheap solution but also the most efficient technique uh, in the long term. But to be honest with you, it can be quite painful at the very start, uh, bloody and messy. So today I'm going to show you with this short tutorial how to uh, get rid of sticky situation, meaning all those wax stands that you can find on your device or worktop. This is what I'm using, it's a roll-on wax um, heater and it has been with me for almost four years. Uh, it came with me from Italy and it's like it's like brand new, nice and clean and fully functioning. Everything you need to uh, get your device like that is already in your house, so open your cupboard. I'm going to show you what you need. See, your wax heater can get really, really dirty and sticky as well. It's not really nice to touch something like that and use it too. But it's really easy to clean it. Just follow me. Sticky, sticky, hmm? Hey, wait. What are you doing with that thing? No, it's too strong for that. Nope. No, no. Listen, have you got any oil in the kitchen? Go and grab it, stupid duck. two-step cleansing routine for your device and all non-porous uh, worktops such as glass, mirror, um, sink and bathtub, uh, tile floor, vinyl floor. 
And for the first uh, part, you need a basic oil, but highly recommend olive oil because you have it already home, it's safe, it's natural, you can also include it to your beauty routine. For the second step instead, I had to be a little bit more inventive because being experimented, I need to find substitutes for everyday um, products that now I can't find in the UK. So for the second step, I had two options for you. The first one is something that you have already home because you are likely cleansing like a manic in your house. So anti-back wipes common wipes and with this I recommend to use a microfiber cloth this is because wipes are very wet they release some sort of uh, foamy liquid and you don't want that to get inside the crevices of your uh, device it would be too dangerous secondly these wipes also leave some antiseptic uh, sticks and by wiping you avoid this problem as well the second uh, the second option is that is an um, antiseptic cleansing solution and this is so far my my favorite uh, option and it's always helpful to have on in case of any emergency let's make life easier if you enjoyed this video if you find it helpful please subscribe to this channel and click the bell button so that you know every time there's something new on this uh, channel you can like it and share it with your friends in the comment box below you're going to find everything i'm wearing tips about this outfit and my social media and remember if you are on instagram you're more than welcome to come and say hello i'm at valenskiliko i wish you a squeaky clean and happy day bye